Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I wanted to do my very long-awaited Smile Direct Club unboxing slash how's it going so far slash just to give you guys some information on how it's going and, and all of that. I really did want to do an unboxing when I first got it, but I didn't get a chance to sit down and film it and it was a Monday night. Um, and I ended up having to go do a million things that night so I didn't get a chance to, to sit down and film it and I really wanted to start that Monday night before I went to sleep with my first set of retainers um, so I didn't get a chance to film it but I did still want to film a unboxing video and share with you guys so far you know what they provide you with the cost um, different things like that so if you are interested in seeing this video then just keep watching So for the longest time, I had seen ads about Smile Direct. I've seen video, uh, I've seen commercials, I've seen YouTube videos, I've seen multiple um, different, uh, you know, ads regarding Smile Direct Club, and I wanted to give it a try just because I've always had my so for, with my teeth, they've always had gaps, and I've never had like any issues with them being crooked. I don't have really an intense amount of work that my teeth needs to undergo in order to get them semi perfect because I mean let's be honest nothing in life is perfect and I think as much as I can try to get my teeth to be perfect it's not gonna happen um, but since my um, teeth though I don't really have an extensive amount of work I've gone to um, the orthodontics most multiple times to different places um, to get a consultation for braces I've always wanted to do traditional braces when it comes to my gaps um, because mainly where I have my gaps is on the top of my teeth and I have a couple here and there at the bottom but for the most part all of my teeth are pretty straight um, I don't have any overbites or things like that. I don't have anything that's drastic where I need to get braces, like traditional braces, and that it's gonna be, you know, years of me having to wear them. Um, when I've gone to the orthodontist before, um, they've told me that the max that I would probably need my braces would be six months because I only really have spacing issues um, So I decided that I would try the smile direct club because I had seen mixed reviews regarding how people felt about this and I really think that it's every it's a different experience for everybody and I can't oh for things like this I can't always go on um, based on people's experience just because everybody's teeth is gonna be different everybody's gonna need different types of work with their teeth um, so I thought that for me for the issues that I have that's really much just my gaps I thought this would be a great thing for me to try especially because it's very cost like it's very cost efficient it's not as expensive as Invisalign it's not as expensive as getting regular braces um, so I really wanted to give this a try so I scheduled a consultation for May I went on I went in on May 1st um, you know just to see how it would go I, there's two ways that you can do these appointments for your consultation you can either just order your box um, a home kit that they send to your home you pay for that and then I think you pay for that or I'm not sure if it's free or not because I didn't do it that way but they send you the home kit and you basically create the molding and take pictures of your teeth and send it back to um, the center where they create your aligners. Um, I actually went into a Smile Direct shop and got my teeth um, taken pictures of so they took the pictures for me because I didn't want to do the home kit since I had an office right around the corner for my job. I'd rather just go in and make sure that they do it right so that I don't have any issues with creating my molding um, wrong and then having to have them send it back for me to recreate. I just didn't want to go I didn't want a chance going back and forth with them so I ended up going into the Smile Direct store um, they took pictures of my teeth they showed me how everything went um, they actually gave me this bag at the end and it just had inside a smile this is a bright on LED accelerator light so this is just a whitening kit um, for me to whiten my teeth which is pretty cool and it comes in a case like this and then inside the cool thing about this is that you actually um, plug this into your cell phone and you can you can plug it into your cell phone you can plug it into a USB and it's just an LED light that you can take on the go to whiten your teeth wherever and then it also came with a whitening um, stick so that was pretty neat so they gave me that at the consultation along with a smile stretcher this is so that I can take pictures of my teeth throughout the progress um, through you know throughout the every time I change out my al aligners I take pictures of my teeth just so that at the end I can see the progress that I made and how long it took me to see the progress um, so they gave me that and then they gave me a pamphlet also with the information regarding my aligners and the payment plan things like that so they have two forms of payment plans they have it's 1850 so it's 1850 if you want to pay it all up front 
or that's option one. And then option two is you give a uh, 250 down payment and it's 24 months for $80 a month. Um, so you can really go whichever route you feel. Obviously the 1850 up front, if you can save up for it, that's probably the best way to go just because you end up saving money. Um, at the end of option two, you would end up paying a, a 2170 and you can save a lot more by just paying it all up front. So um, my suggestion is if you want to do this, I recommend just saving up for it and paying it all up front so that way you don't have to pay the extra money. But anyways, um, so I went in on May 1st for my consultation, I decided to do it, so I paid it, sent off my aligners to be sent, to be made, and then it took about, they told me it would take four to, I want to say four to five weeks um, for my aligners to arrive. They arrived at the four week mark, which I was really excited about, so I got them on June forgot what date in June I got them. Well, I can tell because I know when I started my aligners. So, I started my aligners on Monday, June 11th. Um, so that was Monday night. So um, that day I got my box, at, I had it shipped to my job so that I you know, knew when it would arrive. Um, so I got my box, it, ca it came in this huge purple box, which is really cool. And then it, what I really liked about this is that they give you all of your aligners up front, um, so you can go switching them out. You don't have to wait for them to come in the mail. You can go switching them out every time, you know, it's time to change your aligners. Um, so basically what the box what the box looks like, it looks like this. So um, on the inside, the first tray, which is this top one here, you'll get some um, little cards. These are just share your um, before and after picks to win aligners, share the smiles, just share cards. Um, so it comes with this little Ziploc bag that says Chewy's aligner tray setters, and then it comes with a little stick for you to, to remove or um, you know, to for you to basically take out your aligners if you can't use your fingers. Um, this just helps you take out your aligners. And then the Chewy's are for once you put your aligners in place, you put you chew on them so that to, to make sure that they click. So they do make a click like a click sound once they are set in the place where they should be. Um, so then they also give you this lip balm, which I have one that they gave me from the consultation actually, which is in my purse. And I use this all the time. My lips get so dry from wearing these aligners. Um, also, if you hear a lisp, um, I've pretty much gotten used to wearing them to the point where I can, um, you know, control the lisp. But if you do hear a slight lisp, is because I am wearing my aligners. Um, but yeah, this lip balm has helped me so much because my lips dry out so, so much and they end up burning from you know taking out or wearing my aligners so that's that and then they also give you this little container mine is actually like already wearing out like the smile direct club logo is wearing out but this is just so that you can take out your aligners whenever you're gonna eat um, if you're gonna drink anything that's not water you're supposed to remove your aligners put them in here and then you can eat um, you should you should be washing your brushing your teeth every time you finish eating or drinking something that's not water um, just to avoid any cavities things like that so I just take this in my bag wherever I go and then they also included this um, four of these whitening gels just so that I can whiten my teeth throughout the process and have pretty white teeth and then so for so these are my tr month one week one so they come in little a little baggies like this so you have your second tray which just comes with um, your first set of aligners this is my month one week one which I already wore and it just gives the doctor um, information and also I guess some coding I don't know it just says my name and the code I guess that's the aligners code. I don't know what that is um, but my aligners look like this and these I already wore. These were the first sets of aligners that I wear. Um, I'm not throwing any of them out just in case that I do end up needing them for any reason. I don't know. Um, so I've just been keeping it. So these are my first aligners. Um, day one through three, I'm not going to lie. Um, the first night, I felt a little bit of pain. It was very minor. I put them on before I went to sleep so I could sleep through the pain. But when I woke up on Tuesday, um, when I removed them to brush my teeth in the morning, putting them back in was the worst pain I had ever felt in my mouth. It was just so painful. And then um, Tuesday night when I was brushing my teeth, um, before after eating dinner, I went to put them back on and the pain was even more intense than I felt that morning. 
morning I even like tears were coming out of my eyes and I almost gave up um, because it was just so painful but I was like you know what this is what you want you want to close your gaps you have to do it stick through you know suck up through the pain I did take some ibuprofen ibuprofen was my best friend for the first three days um, because that second day was the worst it was just the most painful experience I've ever felt with my teeth in general um, uh, but the first day the pain was bearable the third day it still hurt but not as bad as that second day the pain was a little bit more tolerable on day three and then after day three everything was smooth sailing after that my my um, aligners would fall into place they do start to get looser towards the end so don't be concerned about that because it is a part of the process it just means your teeth are lining up to where they're supposed to be which is why they get easier to put in to, to put in and take out um, so don't be too concerned if you feel like your aligners are just getting looser that is a part of the process um, and I read that somewhere in the pamphlet too um, so that's month one week one and I'm wearing currently one, uh, month one week two and then tomorrow I'll be switching to month one week three and four the last week of the month is you those aligners are uh, the ones that you wear for two whole weeks um, so I'm really excited to switch these out I know it's probably gonna be painful um, I will say that when I switched to week two my I think it's because they were obviously a little bit more snug and tighter but I didn't feel any pain I think my teeth are now I think that first uh, a couple days or the first week my teeth were just like you know what the hell are you doing like what is this what's going on so I think they were just in shock uh, because of what I was doing to them so by week two when I switched to my new aligners that were tighter um, they didn't feel I didn't feel any pain it, I felt pressure obviously and the tightness of it um, so I just took ibuprofen just to you know make sure I didn't get a headache because of that tightness and because of the pressure but as far as pain so I didn't have any pain for week two so I was really excited about that um, so tomorrow I'll be switching switching to week three and four and I'm really excited about that as well um, but you get all of your aligners for every for the remainder of your program the amount of time that I have to wear mine um, I think my program is so each there's like levels and there's just all your aligners um, and then you have this card at the bottom where it says nice you're getting close to the smile to a smile you'll love and then it says time to order your retainers this is just to let you know that it's time that you it's time to order your retainers so that you get them in time by the you get them in time by the time you're finished with your program um, so it just says time to order your retainers ask smiles savers for 99 a set and then your um, retainers I believe it's every six months or something like that you're supposed to be switching them out you wear them at night replace them every six months they're only $99 a set discount plans available so really excited about having to order my retainers and then the last one it says this fresh batch of smiles was made just for you by Jess and then this is my last set of retainers which is my fifth month for my fifth month I'll wear it for week one week two and then week three and four so um, I'm supposed to be done with my program I believe it was October 22nd and what I really appreciate also about the smile direct club is that they kept me informed through emails like throughout the four weeks that I was waiting for my box to arrive I would get email updates on where they were at in the progress and they were really cute emails they were very fun to read so I really appreciate that um, and yeah so that was that and so far I'm very excited about the progress that my teeth are making like I said I don't have any crooked teeth so that's why I thought this would be a good program for me to join because it's not much work that my teeth needed I've always wanted to get braces I really wanted to get traditional braces because I was always afraid that if the pain was too intense um, that I would want to take them off and the pain was really bad for the first three days especially Tuesday that Tuesday Oh, I, I don't even want to rethink about that Tuesday because I was in so much pain but um, so I've always wanted to get traditional braces because of that pain I wouldn't have that option to take them off but I fought through it I stuck through it I almost gave up even my boyfriend was like babe you're beautiful as you are you don't need them I'm like but I already paid for it so I need to do it but um, yeah I'm really excited I was I've always wanted to get my teeth straightened because I have those gaps not straightened I've always wanted to close my gaps I was never 
insecure about my teeth. Um, I've never had any issues with insecurity with my teeth. I did have insecurity with my boobs, which you guys saw in my, um, you know, when I did my surgery and all of that. And that was something that I was always super insecure about. But this is just not something that I was insecure about ever. And then when I actually, I became insecure about my teeth once I actually ordered my aligners and I was in that four week period where I was waiting for my box to arrive, I became so insecure about my teeth. I don't know why. I just, I, the, my gaps were just getting to me and I would pay attention to other people's teeth I don't know if it's because you know now I was starting this new um, program soon and I was just really excited or something but I just became really like insecure about my teeth almost um, where to the point where I stopped smiling in pictures I know it sounds ridiculous but um, I stopped smiling in pictures and I wouldn't want to show my teeth in any pictures things like that so I was really excited when my program my box uh, for my retainers came in for my aligners um, I have seen, like I said, I did see mixed reviews about how people feel about this. I feel like this is just one of those things where you're going to have to either spit out the money and try it out for yourself because everybody's teeth is so different um, that it's just, it's hard to go off of somebody else's review. When I was looking at reviews, honestly, I was focused on, well, did you see any changes? Um, did you, you know... The, the before and after pictures, I kind of created my own opinion of their experience based on what they showed. So that's the way I looked at it because it really is hard to, you know, see somebody else's experience with it with versus your experience with it because, like I said, it's everybody's teeth is different. It's so hard to like compare yours with somebody else's. Um, so in my opinion, so far, I haven't seen, obviously, I'm only on, and then this is another thing that I saw in people's reviews. People were expecting changes in like two weeks and it's like, okay, that's a little ridiculous. Like I'm expecting changes in like three months. Like that's a little bit more realistic and I feel like even though it's been two weeks I have seen somewhat changes oh another side note when I started wearing my aligners the first week my teeth became so sensitive um, when I would take the aligners out to eat it was very difficult to chew my teeth were very very sensitive um, I do have gingivitis which is a thing where like your gums bleed this is something my dentist has always told me that I need to floss more because I get gingivitis where my gums bleed um, so I think I've also been grinding my teeth at night when I sleep. I think I've been putting too much pressure on my on my teeth um, because it is something weird that you're putting in your mouth. Your mouth's not used to having that in there. Um, so I think when I sleep, I've been um, squeezing my teeth tight because I'll wake up and there'll be blood inside my bottom trays. Um, so just be careful with that as well. I'm trying to like sleep with my mouth open as bad as that sounds um, just so that I don't grind on my teeth. And um, so far, I, I'm still... I guess biting really hard when I sleep so I don't know um, I'm gonna have to figure out how not to do that when I sleep but anyways um, that's another side note what was I gonna say before I was talking about something what was I talking about I don't know I can't remember I lost track but anyways um, so yeah so I so far I feel like I've seen some changes I feel like my teeth are already starting to like push together um, mostly on my side gaps I can see the difference I don't know if you can so you see I'll share my before and after pictures obviously um, I will share that with you guys once I have you know some progress because right now my teeth are pretty much the same way they are they are pretty easy to take off and put on I don't want to do it now because I just painted my nails and I'm don't want to mess them up because they're not fully dry yet but um, yeah I'm very happy with the program so far like I said I'm not expecting any changes anytime soon I know it's the beginning stages so I'm just looking forward to the end result which is gonna be in October um, so I do you do create an, an online account for your um, aligners so I'm gonna go to mine really quick just to show you guys um, what it looks like you basically sign in once you have your aligners you check your aligners in to make sure that you are on track and it's just a way of letting them help you make sure that you're on track with your aligners if you miss a day you just go ahead and add it so that you get get back on track um, to seeing when your you know smile will be complete um, so I have a dashboard and in my dashboard it says you have one day until um, you until you swap aligners um, and it says current set month one week two started on Monday June 11 it says next set Monday um, week month I'm sorry <laughs> next set month one weeks three and four switch on Monday June 18th which is tomorrow and then 
it has a little calendar with a circle of when the date is for you to you know change up your aligners and then it says off schedule let us know if you missed a day start or started early or if you're uh, off track so you can get back on track and then it says your future smile is just on the horizon I have 126 more days for my program aligners remaining I have 14 and it also gives you a percentage chart so I'm 9% into my program which is really exciting um, and then it gives you a smile ETA which is October 22nd for me so I'm really excited Excited because my birthday is in November so that means I'll have my beautiful smile um, for my birthday and yeah I'm really excited about it this is something I've always wanted to do and so far I'm happy with the way things are going I have no complaints other than the fact that it hurts like a mother um, on day two and that I'm still trying to figure out how to get my bottom gums to stop bleeding um, because so far it's been two days in a row where I'll wake up with blood on my bottom aligners and I really think it's because I'm chewing really hard while I sleep um, because I feel the tension when I'm sleeping um, in my teeth so yeah that is it for my unboxing I hope this video was helpful let me know if you guys have any questions um, I will keep you guys updated throughout my process pro progress I think I'm thinking of doing a monthly video um, for this uh, for my program so I'll do my next update next month and just share with you guys where I'm at and if you guys have any questions I'll answer them there um, so after a week um, so I'll just do a month of a monthly video for this um, program so yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this video um, don't forget to subscribe if you haven't already and I will see you guys in my next one bye guys